So general order number 18. This is from Patton to his troops. Soldiers of the seventh army born at sea, baptized in blood and crowned with victory. In the course of 38 days of incessant battle and unceasing labor, you have added a glorious chapter to the history of war. Pitted against the best Germans and Italians could offer, you have been unfailingly successful. The rapidity of your dash, which culminated in the capture of Palermo, was equaled by the dogged tenacity with which you stormed Trinia and captured Messina. Every man in the army deserves equal credit. The enduring valor of the infantry and the impetus ferocity of the tanks were matched by the tireless clamor of our destroying guns. The engineers performed prodigies in the construction and maintenance of impossible roads over impassable country. The services of maintenance and supply performed a miracle. The signal corps laid over 10,000 miles of wire and the medical department evacuated and cared for our sick and wounded. On all occasions, the Navy has given generous and gallant support. Throughout the operation, our air has kept the sky clear and tirelessly supported the operation of the ground troops. As a result of this combined effort, you have killed or captured 113,350 enemy troops. You've destroyed 265 of his tanks, 2,324 vehicles, and 1,162 large guns. And in addition, you've collected a mass of military booty running into the hundreds of tons. But your victory has a significance be above and beyond its physical aspect. You have destroyed the prestige of the enemy. The President of the United States, the Secretary of War, the Chief of Staff, General Eisenhower, General Alexander, General Montgomery, have all congratulated you. Your fame shall never die. G.S. Patton, Jr., Lieutenant General, U.S. Army, Commanding. So you were talking about getting fired up and what he would do to get get people fired up? Mm -hmm. There you have it. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, a very skilled writer with great command of the language. Can you even imagine what you'd feel like hearing that address to you and your, your people, you and your troops, you and your brothers? Yeah, 